his A game with him and his couple of his passes in the early stages have just gone astray, which we're not used to seeing. Jack Green finds Timothy in space and he's got a shot on him, Timothy. Drives in a goal and it's first beaten Utah into the bottom corner. The first time the Kagalan United have got on the front foot and Anthony Timothy finds the net. Lovely for football. Minoski's got a bit of space here. Trying to deliver something into the panel here. Yeah, Max Green arrives and it's 2 0. A brilliant cross in, and Max Green gets on the score sheet again, and it's double trouble for Canberra Olympic. Gagarin are firing. What a ball in from Eight of their last ten goals in League and Cup have been scored in the second half, so they are more of a second half side based on that. They might get one back here, though. Here's Thomas James, and they do. Incisive, and for the first time, they get their main man in, and he finds the target. His first goal in Canberra Olympic colours, and they pass the deficit right on half time. Flores in the middle, that's where it's aimed at Flores, he's got the head on it, on his drops in, Luca Flores with a stunning header, Quinn was completely baffled and it's looped over the goalkeeper's head and just like that, Canberra Olympic find themselves level. Spari, space for Giampaolo, sell up nicely for him, Giampaolo, what a way to win it, a stunning finish from Dominic Giampaolo, rolling back the years. Two minutes in the stoppage time, and the Gunners look like they've taken the points. Well, Gerbisher steps in. Kia, Dominici, Greco, Canberra, Croatia advancing. Ugrinic, ball in for Greco, lets it run. Real chance here for Steven Dominici. It's deflected and it's in. Canberra, Croatia, slick rat -a -tat, one way end to the other. It took a deflection, they don't care. Dominici on target again. Plenty to aim for in the penalty area. Swung towards the far post. Militinovic rises and it's nodded in. And it's what a piece. And it's Josh Golevsky, I believe. Could have been Carl Senior. Or maybe it was Carl Senior. It was one of the two. Big five minutes, this feels like. Tineski. Look at the pace to get into the penalty. Yeah, Nick Tineski going all the way himself. Denied by Brown. Out for Kishta through the crowd. And the Tigers lead. They've turned it around. 1-0 down, 2-1 up. There's New Greenwich over it to deliver the quality if he can. It's flat. Everyone's missed it. It's deflected. It's loose. It must be. It is. On his birthday, from a yard, Daniel Balac rescues a point for Canberra, Croatia. It went all over the place. Kishta to take. His goal, we thought it won it for the Tigers. His corner swung in. And it's nicked on. And it's turned in again. And it's Marco Milutinovic! Would you believe it? The Tigers have won it! Six minutes into stoppage time. A dramatic ending to this incredible encounter.
it's like, I think it's great. Right. You can support him, support him. We're all in this together. Connor Marlett Smith. In the corner, goes short. Look at Got away from Truman. Pulls it across the six yard box. Here's Michael John. Opens up, scores. Michael John on the turn. Wasn't going to miss this one. Second chance inside the six yard box. And for the second NPL game in a row, Michael John opens the scoring for the Panthers. They're not helping themselves here. Connor Minot Smith has it. Strickers is in. Strickers in on the other side. It's Rocco Stricker. Oh, penalty, penalty, surely. No Look. doubt about it. Who gave it away? With Roy Romeo's miscontrol. And Connor Minot Smith has set it up. And sure has given it. Stricker was the man brought down. He's the one lining up the spot kick. Up against Christian Nell in the Wanderers' goal. Ficker for two, sends the keeper the wrong way, never going to miss it. And the Panthers double their lead five minutes before the interval. Yeah, well deserved. And again, trying to play out from the back, first counter, I know it's admirable, but as soon as you muck up there, you're in trouble.